Okay, I'm going to make the knee controls now. So I'm just going to get into my, uh, just my front view. And I'm just going to draw a curve just uh, up here. And then I'm going to just draw the curve just around my knee. I press W to move, press and hold V to snap to point. All right. And I might just command D, duplicate over and uh, snap, pressing V again. All right, so I've just made two controls. And uh, while I'm here, I'll just give them some names. So that's R underscore knee underscore control and L underscore knee underscore control. Okay, there we go. Okay, now I just want to get these two controls and I'm just going to bring them out, uh, just outside, bring them out a bit, just say uh, maybe about here. All right, now need to select them and again, edit, delete by type, history. All right, and again, modify, freeze transformations. Once again, these can really cause a pain if you forget to do them. Modify, freeze transformations. All right, there we go. And just do that on your uh, second one as well. Edit, delete by type, history, modify, freeze transformations. Good. Now, what I want to do is I want to select my control and then shift click on my IK handle. All right, there we go. So your handle, sorry, your uh, control should be white. And then what we wanna do is we want to go to constrain and pole vector. All right, and we hit okay. All right, so you'll see now that there's a bit of a, why didn't that work? Yep, okay, there we go. It is uh, working. Good, yep, if we select on our IK handle, you can see how that works. So do it again with your other knee. Okay, select your control, shift click the IK handle and constrain point. Oops, what happened there? All right, chose the wrong one, what happened? One and two, all right. Constrain, pole vector. Okay, I chose the wrong thing. Constrain, constrain, pole vector. Okay, good, that works. All right, and there we go. Yep, it's moving along now. Maybe you want both the knees to, uh, to, to move together. We can just uh, make another control. All right, I'm just gonna make another circle. Could be better to use text for this. Oops. All right, so I'm just gonna select a circle like so. It might just change its look. All right, just like that. All right, bring it out. <coughs> All right, there we go. So I've got it like look like so. And I might just say call this knees underscore control, okay? Now, all we've got to do is I think I select my first control Shift click the uh, the main control and edit parent. Okay, so hopefully, yep, good. Do that. Do that with the second one. Shift click on the main one and edit 
and parent. Okay, there we go. So that way, you've got, say, one control that will... Uh, oh, and I just knew I did forgot to do it. Um, damn it. Edit, delete by type history and modify freeze transformations. Always forget that. All right. Good, there we go. Always remember, delete your history and freeze transformations. But there you have it, okay? You've got a control for that.